Hi guys, today I'm bringing you a frugal quick tip update. These are my family cloths. As you can see, they look clean. I just washed them. These things are a year old. I had a subscriber send these to me a year ago and I was really, really impressed. These were made out of a pillowcase, a couple of pillowcases, and she sent them to me and she said she hoped I wouldn't be offended. A year later, I am not offended. These things have been a lifesaver. A family cloth is what you use for when you go to the bathroom to for the wet stuff, just saying. The poopy, you can still use your toilet paper. It actually saves you in the long run lots of toilet paper throughout the year. This is our old timey chamber pot that I just keep water and fresh scent pine saw in. And when you use them, you just drop them in there and wash every two to three days according to how often you need to wash them. And I wash my cloths by themselves. I put them in a small amount of water and washing powder, wash them, hang them out to dry, and you're good to go again. This has been something I have used for one year religiously to see how I liked it. And they hold up so well. Granted, these are um, flannel pillowcases. She cut them up in, and I'm not sure if the size is exactly, it's um, like four by eight little sheets, I guess. And when you use them, you trifold like this. And I'm going to tell you, I had to use toilet paper while I was on my trip to Tennessee and believe me, toilet paper for wet stuff is just so thin. You have to use so much of it. This I have gotten so used to that it is it's just awesome. And I wash these. They've been washed, oh, in a year, like every three to four days for a year. And you can't tell they've even been hurt. There's no stains. There's no scent. Um, trying to think what else somebody would say. Um, it's really no bother. I was really kind of glad when she sent them. I was excited. But I wanted to know for, for me how it would work, how it would save on toilet paper. So this is an update. I have saved probably... Gosh, who would even know how many rolls of toilet paper this year by using only the wet stuff using these. And I'm going to tell you, you can buy flannel baby sheets like the receiving blankets and make them, cut them up and make them. You don't have to stitch them like this if you don't want to. You can just cut them and use them as is. They will ravel faster, but if you do a um, this is a zigzag stitch around the edges and I don't know if you can see that but she's folded it back and it works really well but if you don't want to sew just simply get those baby receiving blankets at a second hand store you, I, I picked up gosh four or five for a dollar a piece that weren't hurt so you can use anything you want but the flannel works really really well and baby receiving blankets are perfect or old flannel sheets if you have flannel sheets that you um, have in the closet or you find them at a second hand store for little or nothing cut them up and do this and this is just like the most excellent way to save money on toilet paper family cloths thank you guys